Praise God. Praise God again. Um, I hope you're doing well wherever you are at home. Uh, my name is Teacher Maureen. I'm Teacher Wanjohi and I'm born again. Yeah. Welcome to today's service. Um, I hope you have your Bibles ready. I hope, I hope you also have your notebooks because uh, today is going to be a very good learning session. Sawa sawa. Karibuni sana. So I uh, will start with a word of prayer and let's pray. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your love towards us. We thank you that you've given us another day to see, Father, another day to worship you and to praise you and to be in your presence. Thank you for the word that we will hear. Thank you that even as we praise you, we will praise you, Father, in truth and in spirit, and our hearts will be there as we praise you, O God. And even as we start our lesson, Father, we pray that you may open our hearts to receive what you have prepared for us, uh, may your name be glorified and may your name be lifted high. In Jesus' name we pray and believe. Amen. 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 So we'll go straight to praise. Um, so let's clap our hands. <laughs> loving Jesus, loving Jesus, loving Jesus, what a wonder you are. I love you so, so much, loving Jesus. Loving Jesus, what a wonder you are. Loving Jesus, loving Jesus. Loving Jesus, what a wonder you are. I love you so, so much. Loving Jesus, loving Jesus, what a wonder you are. Caring Jesus, caring Jesus. Caring Jesus, what a wonder you are. I love you so, so much. Caring Jesus, caring Jesus, what a wonder you are. Oshé, 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 bam, 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 oshé, 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 Oh, bam, bam, bam. Loving Jesus, loving Jesus. Loving Jesus, what a wonder you are. I love you so, so much. Loving Jesus, loving Jesus, what a wonder you are. Caring Jesus, caring Jesus. Caring Jesus, what a wonder you are. I love you so, so much. Caring Jesus, what a wonder you are. Oh, she, oh, she, oh, oh, she, oh, oh, she, bam, 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 oh, she, oh, she, oh, oh, she, oh, oh, she, bam, bam, bam. He has given me victory, I will lift him higher. Jehovah will lift him higher. He has given me victory. I will lift him higher. Jehovah will lift him higher. 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 Amen. And now we will now go to worship and I pray that you may prepare your hearts and really worship God from your heart. Let's uh, worship. Tuna kuwa budu bana tuna kuwa Do not to kiss him. 
pray. Uh, Father, we thank you that you are truly good and you deserve all the honor and all the glory, Father. God, even as we start our lesson, God, even as we start to hear from you, may you uh, prepare our hearts to receive from you and also to hear from you. Speak to our hearts, O God, and let us uh, learn from you. In Jesus' name we pray and believe. Amen. 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 So now we're going to go to the children's creed and we will say it together. Sawa, sawa. I believe in God, the Father of who loves me and hates sin, and in His Son Jesus Christ, who died for my sins. I believe if I repent, He will forgive me and give me His Holy Spirit. I pray to Him diligently. Amen. 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 Uh, so the next session we actually have something prepared for you guys and we have a bible trivia so i'd like you to prepare your notebooks and your pens and uh try this out and see how many you can get um i believe it's going to be fun and it's going to teach you a lot so let's head over here so i'm going to take you through the bible trivia and i want you to learn a bit about joshua today um, so I'd like you to take your pen and your notebook and write down the answers that you think are correct Then we will see if you are right at the end of it all But either way we are still learning so don't take it too hard on yourself. So the first question uh, Whom did Joshua succeed as a leader of Israel? Whom did Joshua succeed as a leader of Israel? A. Jacob B. Aaron C. Moses D. Abraham. Okay, write down the answer. Second question, what was the name of Joshua's father? What was the name of Joshua's father? A. Carmi. B. Nan. C. Othniel. D. Eliaza. Question three, to what city did Joshua send two men to spy upon? To what city did Joshua send two men to spy upon? A. Jericho. B. I. C. Gilgal, D. Heshbon. Question number four. According to Joshua chapter 1 verse 6, what did God tell Joshua? Be strong and... Question number five. Why did God tell him this? So I hope you have written down your questions, your answers, sorry. And uh, so I'm going to reveal the answers and see how you have done. So question number one, Joshua took after Moses. Question number two, Joshua's father was none. Question number three, Joshua sent two spies to Jericho. Question number four, God told Joshua, be strong and of good courage. Question number five, um, in this question, uh, I would like Teacher Wanjohi to take you through it because this is what we are going to be learning about today. Teacher Wanjohi. Thank you, Teacher Maureen, for leading us through the Bible trivia. It was indeed enjoyable. And I hope children you've enjoyed that. I hope you've learned something new. And today, our lesson will be based on what Teacher Maureen has taken us through those questions. And let's get along together. And our today's topic, our today's topic is our today's topic is what? Do you know it? It is me, teacher, who is telling you what our topic is. And our topic today is courage in time of adversity. Courage in time of adversity. And this is what our topic is, as you see it here on the blackboard. Courage. In time of... Time of adversity. And we get it from the book of Joshua, chapter 1, verses 1 to 9. Joshua, chapter 1, verses 1 to 9. We not read it, all of it, because Jamorin has taken us through some of what it says. She said, it talks about Joshua and someone who was called Moses. And in chapter 1, verses 1, we are told that Joshua was given the mandate to lead the children of Israel from Moses. Moses was the one who was leading the children of Israel from where? Egypt 
to Canaan. And now today we are concentrating on someone who is called Joshua. And the reason why we are concentrating on the person Joshua is because of the character that he had. And one of his characters that we are dealing with today is courage. Say courage. 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 All right? Courage. That's what we are dealing with today. Then there is something else that we need to, to see. There is something that is called there is time. Time. Time ni masa. Unaona masa? Time. Then there is adversity. Adversity ni mashida. Adversity ni miteremko. Unapada, unashuka. Hizo mashida zote. Hiyo ndiyo tunaita adversity. So leo, I want us to learn about Joshua. Someone who is called Joshua. And something is, which is courage and adversity and time. Just to tell you about Joshua. And remember teacher Maureen had a question that he said I will answer? Do you remember that question? The question was why did God tell most Joshua that he needs to be courageous and to be strong? Strong ni strength. Strength ni enye tunasamanga boys, tunasamanga strength ni hii inakuanga hape initangu wa geshoka. Iyo ndiyo strength. Na alikuwa nambiwa akwe strong. Akwe mtu strong. Strong ni watu enye tunawananga wanainua mawe juu wanakuanga na wakiwa strong. So, and he was told to be courageous. And the reason why he was told to be courageous, Moses had given him the children of Israel to lead them to the, the promised land. You remember the story of the children of Israel? They crossed through the river Jordan, then they were supposed to go and occupy a land that was the promised land, which was Canaan. So, he had to be, and the land that we are, they were going to, the land had people who were huge, the people who were there knew how to fight, and because they said we are, could be terrified, he was told to be courageous. And to encourage them, he said to be courageous. So he had to be very strong. I hope we are together up to that point. So we are up to where Joshua now is told to be strong. And the reason why he is told to, to be strong in the land that he was going, there are people who, tribes, and the, the, the nations that were strong there, and he needed to be strong. Because they needed to go and fight so that they occupy that land. And what I need us to learn today, as students, we are at home now. Why, why are we at home? Can you tell mom why you are at home? Can you remind mom why you are at home? Tell your brother, tell your sister, tell your dad why you are at home. It is cause of something that we call coronavirus. That is why we are at home, we are not going at school, while we are supposed to be going at school. And that coronavirus is what we are calling Adversity. Adversity na tumesema ni mashida. Na hiyo ndiyo shida enye tukonayo sa hizi ni ya corona. Sisa hizi si kila mtu tunayenda na anavalia kitu ni ito barakoa. Mask. Kila mtu za hizi anambiwa varia mask ukitoka. Kaa nyumbani. Usitoke enje ukacheze na watoto wengine ukai kwenu nyumbani. Washi wa hazi. Watoto wadowa anasema aje. Na mikono. Washa mikono. Washa mikono. Iyo ndiyo tunambio tu, tufanya watoto wadogo. Lakini watoto wakubwa pia tunambio tusiene huko, nje tukicheza. Na tukitumuwa na mamu kwa duka tunavalia nini? Mask. Wezi ingia supermarket, bila mask. Iyo ndiyo kitu enye tunambio, you have near diversity. But in the midi siya hiyo, kasi si watoto watuendi shule tunawagopa, tunashindo hii corona wakati mungine ni nini. Kuna kakitu tunawana kana choro hivi, kakona tubichwa hivi. Tunambio hako diko kana hitu waka corona, na tunawagopa. Lakini saa hizi mungu anatuambia kazi nyaliambia Joshua be strong and be courageous. And that's what God is telling us be strong and be courageous. Children as you are growing up you'll be getting through so many things. Utakuna wana mabo mingi. Lakini mungu anakuambia be strong and be courageous. So ukiendelea kukua unakuwa strong unakuwa courageous. But courageous in who? In? In who? In God. In who? In God. Be strong and courageous in who? In God. That's what the, the Bible is telling us in the book of Joshua chapter 1 verses 1 verses 9. Ukisoma hapo 9, do inasema? Na tutaifanya mahali, itawanyesha mahali, itafanya tu hiyo, ikiwa memory verse. So, sahibi, tukiwa huko kwa ina wakante. Huko unawanaka kwa TV vitu zingine, mpaka tunambiwa kuna atina wakante, tuna vitu zingine. Sijui hii mnajua inaitua nini? Sijui mnajua inaitua nini? Inaitua locust. Kaa country yetu, a time like this. At a time like, a time like this, tunapata 
kuna vitu zinaitwa mpaka locust zinaenda zinakula kule kwa shushu wetu geshaki zinaenda zinakula mahindi zao zinakula viazi na cabbages hizo zinaitwa locust hiyo ni advance zina mashida zenye zinatupitia lakini Mungu anatuambia tutapitia hizo nasikia hata kuna mvua watu wanaenda unabeba unaona tv watu nyumba zao zimeingia maji hiyo ni shida zingine tuko nazo lakini Mungu anatuambia tukue courageous be strong and courageous cause Mungu hata tuata na anatuambia kama anatupenda hata yeye katoto mdogo Mungu anakupeta mtoto mkubwa hata mimi ni mtoto wa Mungu na mimi ni mtoto wa mama yangu unaona hata wewe Mungu anakupenda unaona vinye mama anakupenda anga anakuletea kitu that's how God also loves you and he loves you with an everlasting love so Leo that's what I needed us to learn that God loves us and I told you in times of adversity wakati wa mashida tukue courageous tukue courageous unaona kasiba marara pale kwa vinyo wanakuanga kwa msitu wanakuwa strong you should be also very courageous na Mungu atakuwa anakubariki na kila wakati tunasemanga tunaomba you cannot be strong and you cannot be courageous if you are not praying pray every day and also do what you always say read the word of God The word of God you inakupatia courage. Wakati unaenda pale unasoma Biblia, unakumbuka Mungu ana promise ukuwe strong, ukuwe courageous. That's what God promise, promises us. So ukiwa hapo nyumbani usiogope, hata ukisikia corona inakuja, Mungu anakuprotecting. Ukikuwa strong na unamuomba, anakuprotect. We unakuwa courageous unatokea nje hivi ukiwa courageous. Lakini ukumbuke serikali inasema tuvalie nini? Mask na barakoa. Na then ukitoka nje ukirudi, wash your hands, wash your hands, unawasha mikono. Na una mekiwa unakaa nyumbani si kwenda aenda kucheza huko nje ili usipate hiyo corona unaona kaka kitu kanaitwa corona usipate hapo kitu kanaitwa corona so Mungu abariki sana nimewaambi sana 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 nimewaambi sana najua tutafunguliwa na serikali ilisema tutarudi kwa kanisa na najua tutakuja hapa tutaanza ku dance ushidi wa Yesu ushidi wa Yesu si ndio so tutaonana na Mungu atatubariki sana sasa saa hizi nataka tufanye kitu inaitwa Sema memory bus. Sema memory bus. Ukiwa hapo nyumbani sema memory bus. Memory bus na kuanga una recite. Unajua kama vinye tunafanyanga kwa class. Tunaenda tika na sema kakaria ndio sasa kile msomo mara ya kwanza ya pili hiyo hii time nyingine unaangalia huko nyuma then unarudia sasa ukiwa uangalii kwa blackboard. Sasa hivi nataka tufanye hivyo. Lakini sasa wewe uta make sure umeiandika ili kila siku unakumbuka hiyo memory bus. Ukiwa ukirudi shule utakuwa unasema you are courageous and you are very strong. So may God bless you so much and uh, I know that you'll be blessed even as you do the memory bus. And that's where now we are going to do the memory bus. Be ready. Ah, teacher Maureen, our memory bus is here with us. I want you to lead even the girls to the memory bus. Ah, we want to take you through the memory bus. Welcome, teacher Maureen. Take us through the memory bus. Okay, so our memory bus for today is Joshua chapter 1 verse 9. I'm sure you know it. We'll go through it together. So it says, and mtarudia na mimi, have I not commanded you? Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Be strong and courageous. Do not be terrified. Do not be terrified. Do not be discouraged. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you for wherever God, you go. For God your Lord, for the Lord, Lord your God, God will be with you. you wherever you go. Again, Joshua chapter 1 verse Joshua chapter 1 verse 9 Have I not commanded you Have I not commanded you Be strong and courageous Be strong and courageous Do not be terrified Do not be terrified Do not be discouraged Do not be discouraged For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go Joshua chapter 1 verse 9 That is our memory verse Thank you so much for being with us in this class. We are so delighted teacher Morin. Wewe umefurahia kama mimi? Nimefurahia sana kuwa na mimi na nimewaambi sana. Mungu awabariki sana. Let us pray. Our heavenly Father, we thank you and bless your holy name. Thank you for being with us in this class and reminding us to be courageous and to be strong even in the midst of coronavirus and in the midst of not going even to school. Dear Lord, we know that you protect us and you love us King of glory. Be with us and also be with our parents Jehovah God. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, do we pray and believe. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus, Jesus Christ and, and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Amen. Watoto msalimie wazazi na mwambie tunapenda sana. 
May God bless you so much. We love you so much. Na Mungu abariki sana. Sawa, barikiwe. Bye bye. Bye.